Have you ever wondered what's at the center of the earth, Tic Tacers? In ancient times, it was believed that hell was there, where the damned suffer for their sins for eternity. That was until science determined that the Earth's core is simply a mixture of liquid and solid metals. This conclusion is based on studies, of course, because no human has ever gotten close. However, in the former Soviet Union, they tried, and what they discovered was as surprising as it was chilling, giving rise to a dark legend that still remains unresolved to this day. Let's go back to the 1960s, during the Cold War. This conflict pitted the United States against the former Russian Republic for world leadership, and one of the main battlefields was science. Both countries fought to lead the space race, with the USSR being the first to send a man into space, although the Americans eventually beat them to the moon. Meanwhile, here on Earth, there was another lesser-known competition to reach the deepest point beneath the surface. The goal was to reach the Mohorovicic discontinuity, where the Earth's crust ends and thus reach the mantle. The depth varies depending on the area, from 70 kilometers deep in mountainous regions to 5 kilometers in some points of the ocean floor. The Americans chose the latter option, which they called the Moho Project. The drilling took place off the coast of Guadalupe Island, Mexico, from an offshore drilling rig and they managed to reach a depth of 601 meters below the seabed. However, the high cost of the project, which was funded privately, led to its abandonment. But the Soviets did not give up so easily. Their project, the Kola Super Deep Borehole, was carried out on land, specifically in Murmansk, in the Baltic Shield area, a very flat region containing the oldest rocks in Europe and they managed to go farther than any human ever had. In 1965, the exact location was chosen, 10 kilometers west of the city of Zapoliarny, and the ambitious goal was set to reach 15,000 meters in depth. The work was slow and costly, and it wasn't until 1979 that they reached 9,600 meters, breaking the record for the world's deepest hole which had been held by the Bertha Rogers oil well in Oklahoma, USA. The workers not only had to build the structure to support the hole, but they also encountered increasing difficulties as they descended, such as high temperatures and the unexpected presence of water pockets at great depths. In fact, in 1984, upon reaching 12 kilometers, a terrible accident occurred. The structure collapsed and the hole was covered with about 5,000 meters of earth, forcing them to start drilling again from the 7,000 meter level. It took five years to reach the previous depth. They hoped to reach the final goal of 15 kilometers by 1993. However, a year earlier, after many unsuccessful attempts, the work was halted at 12,262 meters where the temperature of 180 degrees Celsius caused a continuous flow of mud and boiling hydrogen. Among the many discoveries made while descending to these depths, there was one that earned the Kola borehole the nickname the Hole of Hell. According to a report published by a Finnish newspaper, a team of scientists working at the borehole stumbled upon the discovery of a strange underground cavity. To explore it, they lowered an extremely heat-resistant microphone, along with other sensory devices. The temperature recorded was around 1,100 degrees Celsius, and the microphone picked up a distant sound of screams and human wailing. The interpretation of the discovery was clear. The scientists had reached the very limits of hell itself, and the sound captured was that of the damned souls. The news quickly spread to American newspapers, and the recording of these supposed screams began circulating online. However, it was never confirmed by official sources. The Cola Hole of Hell was handed over to a state-run scientific company for further study, with a geological laboratory located 8.5 kilometers deep. This continued until June 2018, when the project was permanently shut down due to a lack of funding. To this day, the borehole in the secrets it contains remain sealed. But just like with the space race, perhaps one day technological advancements will allow us to go farther. 
and discover firsthand what lies hidden in the depths of the planet. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. And if you want to see more Draw My Life videos, subscribe to our channel. See you in the next episode!